If you don't have to engage in violence, if we really do take nonviolence seriously, I mean, this is really the basic point. If you really take nonviolence seriously, and it's not just, you know, uh, talk, um, if it's sincere and you believe it, why would you kill when you don't have to? When you're making a decision as to what you're going to eat tonight, that there's some sort of conflict between you and the cow or you and the chicken, the answer is no, that's not true at all. You're just making a choice. And if your choice is basically informed by nothing more compelling than palate pleasure, then I question, you know, whether you really are committed to nonviolence or whether you really take morality seriously. Why are we eating, wearing, or using animals at all, particularly when we don't have to? Why do we get upset about what Michael Vick did? Uh, because we get upset that he inflicted suffering and death on animals for no good reason. A re his only reason was entertainment. He enjoyed it. But the bottom line is, what's our justification for killing 58 billion land animals a year uh, and probably a trillion sea animals? What's our justification? We don't need to eat animals to be optimally healthy. Indeed, uh, a lot of mainstream healthcare people are, are questioning, uh, are saying that eating animals is detrimental to your health, but nobody's maintaining you need to eat animals. And, and animal agriculture is an ecological and environmental disaster. I think a lot of people are recognizing that you really can't distinguish between the dog you love and the cow that you're eating. I think even if you don't care about animals, there are important human rights issues here. I mean, it would take between six and 12 pounds of plant protein to produce one pound of flesh. It can take hundreds, thousands of times more water to produce a pound of flesh than a pound of, of, of potatoes or wheat or something. And the bottom line is, is that, you know, we're feeding huge amounts of grain to animals that we're gonna slaughter, that if we took that grain, we could basically feed the world. I mean, this is, I mean, even if you don't care about animals, there are profound human rights issues here. It is the most important aspect of your behavior. So be a vegan, educate others. Please visit howdoigovegan.com.